We'll be making a preemptive strike on the WEC stockpile of nerve gas this time around, Captain. Corporal Reeves will insert you into the main storage facility with a fusion pack. All you need to do is plant it anywhere on the containment unit and everything will blow sky high. Our scientists assure us that the ensuing fireball will totally combust the toxin, rendering it harmless. However, we won't detonate the pack until all our units have evacuated the area. The WEC will assume the snail has talked by now, so they'll be expecting us. We get one shot at this, Captain. Make it count.
stay.
Oh! 
got major despair, Tin Man. They figured out my hocus pocus and have physically cut the access lines leading to almost all the jump pads. But I've managed to convince their power board that your insertion jump pad's already been taken care of. I'm juicing it now, and the colonel has sent the fallback signal to the rest of our troops. It's the only thing I can do. Get over there now or glow. Wizard out. Congratulations on a job well done, Captain. Countless citizens unknowingly owe their lives to you. I understand that there were unexpected complications during your extraction. We have been unable to determine if this was coincidence or more work from your unit spy. If it was, he's learned to vary signal characteristics enough to evade detection. I also thought I should let you know that Senator Snell escaped sometime last night. We have not yet determined the circumstances of his release. However, before he left our hospitality, the Senator informed us that the consortium is building some sort of orbiting weapons platform. We have no clear facts beyond his statement, but we're checking into it. Maxis out. <laughs> 